Hello, and welcome back to The Five Does Lent. Now, my name is Leroy, and today's read comes to you from the book of Matthew, chapter 7, verses 24 through 27. Now, what I'd like you to do is, is to go ahead and pause the video and look that up, and then come on back and we'll read it together. Okay? On your marks. Get set. Did you do it? Nicely done. Okay, let's get going here. Verse 24, it says, Anyone who listens to my teaching and follows is wise, like a person who builds a house on solid rock. Though the rain comes in torrents and the floodwaters rise and the winds beat against that house, it won't collapse because it is built on bedrock. But anyone who hears my teaching and doesn't obey is foolish, like a person who builds a house on sand. When the rains and floods come and the winds beat against that house, it will collapse with a mighty crash. All right, today we're building some towers. And for our firm foundation, we've chosen this table. So the firm foundation is Jesus's teaching and it makes for a good foundation. That wouldn't be possible if we built it on sand. <laughs> that would be foolish. And I want to build a house that will be strong and will last. This is about life. It says that whoever hears Jesus' teachings and follows them is wise. Well, I want to be wise. It's all about a foundation on Jesus. So here's your challenge for today. What I'd like you to do is, is go ahead and build a tower, be it with Legos or blocks or whatever, and then while you're building that, you could talk about some of the things that Jesus wants you to do, things that he teaches you. Um, we want to think about uh, all of the ways Jesus is giving us wisdom as we get older. All right, your parents can help you with that. Before we go, I'd like to pray for you. Dear Heavenly Father, we want a foundation built on your teaching. We want to be like the wise man in this story. I pray that you would help us today. In Jesus' name, amen. All right, uh, sticker, tracking card, get those together. And we will see you again next time on The Five Does Lent.